is Pat Chadwick and in this video I'll be walking you through how to do the leg raises. What is the leg raises? Well the leg raises is an effective core exercise that gives you a rock solid core and a sculpting six pack. There are seven variations that I'll be walking you through in this video but the main one we'll be focusing on is the lion leg raises. What muscle group does the lion leg raises target? Well it targets the abdominals especially the lower abdominals it targets the hip flexors, it targets the lower back, and it targets the quadriceps. The lion leg raises is aimed for those who are at the beginner's level. But don't worry, for those of you who are at the intermediate to advanced level, the six other exercises will benefit you too. Now I'll walk you through how to do the lion leg raises. Now I'll be showing you how to do the leg raises. Let's go. Step one, lie flat into the ground with your palm behind your side and your feet together. Step two, press your lower back flat into the ground by ingestion of core and glutes. For those of you who have an arched back, don't worry, you can prevent this by placing your palm underneath your butt or placing a towel underneath your lower back. Step three, raise your legs up towards the sky until your butt lifts off the floor and your legs are in a 90 degrees angle with your body. Try to keep your legs as straight as possible with your toes pointing. Step four, lower down until your feet are two to three inches off the ground and keep repeating this. Now I'll be showing you the second variation of the leg braces. This variation is called the hanging leg braces. Let's go. Step 1. To perform the hanging leg raises, you'll need a pull-up bar above you that you jump onto and grip in tightly, shoulders width apart. Keep your body straight, feet together and toes pointed. Step 2. Raise your legs up until they're in a 90 degrees angle with your torso. Step 3. Keeping your core engaged, lower your legs down slowly until your feet is above the ground. If you find yourself swinging when performing this, you need to squeeze your core as you lower your legs down very hard to reduce the swing. This exercise is an intermediate level exercise that works on your abdominal muscles, obliques, hip flexors, quadriceps, as well as secondary muscles such as the forearms and the lats, which all contribute to a stronger grip strength. Moving on, the next variation is called the side leg braces. Let's go. Step one. Lie on your side with your hips and feet stacked on top of each other. Your legs should be straight and your head resting on your right arm. Step two, keeping your core engaged, lift your leg up slowly until you feel your hips being tilt upwards. Step three, pulse at the top briefly, then lower down your higher leg down to the starting position. Complete the number of repetitions set, followed by switching sides, performing an equal amount of reps on both sides. An exercise with similar movement to this is the fire hydrant, the clamshell and the standing leg raises. This core exercise is for those who are at the beginner's level. It attacks the core, especially the obliques. It also attacks the glutes and the inner thighs, also known as the hip abductors. This variation is called the weighted leg raises. I will now show you how to do it. Step one, lie flat onto the ground with your hands by your side pressing down onto the floor and keeping your feet together. Step two, put the dumbbell in between your feet, squeezing them and keeping them in a secured place. Step three, press your lower back into the floor by engaging your core and squeezing your glutes to push your hips forward. Step four, raise your legs up towards the sky with your toes pointed until they're in a 90 degrees angle with your torso. Step five, slowly, Lower your legs back down towards the ground with your feet two inches above the floor. This variation is a progression to the lying leg raises. It is an intermediate level exercise which targets the abdominals, the obliques, the hip flexors and the quadriceps. Also, adding more weights will increase the resistance which will improve your muscular strength. This variation is called the six inch leg raises. Here we go. Step one, lie with your back flat onto the floor with your arms on your sides and palms pressing into the ground. Step two, keep your lower back flat by tightening your core and engaging your glutes. 
Step three, raise your legs roughly six inches off the ground with the toes pointed. Step four, lower your legs back down to the starting position with your core engaged. Note that you can make this exercise harder by shortening the distance between your feet and the floor. Originally, you're supposed to raise your feet six inches off the ground, but in this video, I've made it easier by increasing the distance between my feet and the floor. This exercise mainly targets the lower abs, the abdominals, obliques, the hip flexors, the quadriceps, and this is for those who are at a beginner's level. Now I'll show you how to do toes to bar. Let's go. Step one, jump onto the bar with your arms shoulders width apart, grip tightly. Step two, raise your legs up towards the sky, keeping them straight with your toes pointed until it touches the bar. Engage your core at all times. Step three, slowly lower your legs down towards the ground and really focus on engaging your core to reduce the swing. Step four, repeat this process for the number of repetitions set. Your legs might not be straight when performing this exercise, which is due to the lack of hip flexor and hamstring flexibility. I'd highly encourage you to work on these to improve on your form. These variations improve the grip, shoulder and back strength. It works on the abdominal, the hip flexors, the forearms, the lats, the quadriceps, and the glutes. Also, it is an advanced level exercise. Lastly, I will show you how to do the windshield wipers. Step one, jump onto the pull-up bar with a tight grip, shoulders width apart. Step two, raise your legs towards the bar keeping your feet together and toes pointed. Step three, rotate your legs 90 degrees to one side, then followed by a 180 degrees to the other. Repeat this movement for a number of repetitions you've set. This video is an advanced version of the windshield wiper. However, if you're at a beginner to an intermediate level, you can practice the floor windshield wipers. The muscles targeted in this variation are the obliques, the rectus abdominis, the hip flexors, the glutes, the quadriceps, the lats, the forearms, and it will sure give you a pumping grip strength. There you have it. I've talked you through seven variations of the leg braces, starting from lying leg braces, hanging leg braces, side leg braces, weighted leg braces, six inches leg braces, toe touches and windshield wipers. So what are the benefits of leg braces? Well it gives you a sculpted abs as it targets your low abdominals. Also it strengthens your hip flexors as it stabilizes your pelvis and the spine which allows you to exercise more without injuring your lower back. Lastly, it helps burn belly fat. Note that this should be complemented with good diet so that you can gain the most out of this exercise. Thanks for watching guys. Make sure you visit us at www.gymless.org for more videos and tutorials. Also, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.